took billions of years for celled organisms to develop, billions more for what we know as life today to develop itself. Just 10,000 years ago, what we consider modern humans began to truly develop. Today, we have evolved to become the organisms with the most complex minds on our Earth. So what's the next step? How do we continue to evolve? Based on research done by many scientists, although co controversial research, um, it has been shown that we have possibly stopped uh, biologically evolving, or at least how Darwin knew of it, as natural selection. The idea of natural selection was that those who had the, those who inherited traits that would result in the most effective reproductive success would reproduce the most, and as a result, the species would have mostly individuals from uh, with those specific traits. Nowadays, we don't really choose who lives or dies, we choose what kills us. Uh, diseases are often contained to what we consider third world countries. First world countries are less affected by these disasters or diseases. Uh, if there is some natural disaster that wipes out a large amount of individuals from one of the first world countries, in terms of percentages, it's not a large amount. Humanity continues. So. Our next step in terms of evolution, technological advancement is one of the clearest uh, directions for humanity to, to take as our biological evolution has nearly reached its limit. Those who cannot keep up with uh, other organisms of similar species, what happened to them in the past? They died out, they went extinct. Is that what's waiting for us in the future? Do we have, are those who embrace technological advancement going to replace everyone who doesn't?